Hello and welcome to this new World Plant Day edition. I'm Martin Peters, current Plant Foundation president, and I'm here today to talk about the Plant Foundation. First and foremost, it's important to remind ourselves what Plone is. Plone is, of course, the CMS that we all know and love, but it is more than just a CMS. Plone is also a wonderful community of people from all over the world who collaborate online on Plone, the CMS, and meet from time to time during sprints, symposiums, and the annual conferences. And there is Plone, the foundation, a legal entity that supports the community and the CMS. The Plone Foundation was founded in 2004 as a 501 c nonprofit organization based in the US. It is the owner of the code, trademarks, and domain names related to Plone. The foundation provides a decision-making structure for essential community activities and ensures that as Plone grows, it remains a level playing field for all. It also acts as the official voice of Plone. The goal of the foundation is to promote and protect Plone, the community and the CMS. The Plone Foundation have a simple structure. First, we have the heart of the foundation, or membership, from community members who have made significant contribution that benefit the general Plone community. Those applications are reviewed and approved by the membership committee based on merit. We currently have almost 2,090 members separated into two categories, active and emeritus. If you are an emeritus member and you would like to become an active member, please contact the secretary. The board of directors are elected yearly by the Plone Foundation members for a two-year term. It's important to note that you do not need to be a Plone Foundation member to become a board member. We are separated into two cohorts of three and four board members to ensure continuity. The board member is composed of seven voting members and the treasurer. The president who runs the meeting, the vice president who acts as a backup for the president, and the secretary who write the minutes of the meetings. We meet every two weeks and the agendas and meeting minutes are available on Plone.org. The role of the board of directors are to oversee the community to make sure everything is running smoothly. But we do not make decisions about the Plone development and feature. We handle finances, legal obligation and governance. The development of Plone the CMS is handled by our teams and committees. All those teams are managed by the community. The Plone Foundation bylaws require at least a membership committee and a marketing team with a representative of the board. Also, we have sub-communities. One for Zope, the application server, one for Guillotina, and one for Volto. As a non-profit organization, the Plone Foundation depends on sponsors. Start for $5 a month, we have two ways to support Plone. One for organization that you can find on plone.org slash foundation slash sponsorship and one for individual donation via GitHub sponsor program. And here are some examples of what donation and sponsorship allow the foundation to do. Sprint funding, domain names and hosting, marketing. And now you know more about why we exist, please consider joining us. To become a Plone Foundation member, please visit plone.org slash foundation slash members. Also, you can follow us on X and Mastodon. And you can take part of our community via GitHub or forum and Discord. Thank you for watching this presentation. I wish you a wonderful World Plone Day and hope to see you at one of our future events.